Hello everybody, this is Hope. Oh. Hello everybody, this is Bbundy09 and we are starting chapter three, the riddle. Okay. I ain't going near that crusty butler dude again. You go pay him a visit. I'll go with Bonehead here and try and find a phone to call for help. Okay, we're in the grand hallway. I have one health. Um look for that bonus book. The daggum bonus book. Why have to be so hard to find? Plus I have one health. Okay, let's not get hit by that. Um, are you up here? Maybe one of these things. Ah, health! I can use that. More health. And we're still kind of... We can't go upstairs yet. Um... Okay. In there. Trader Fever yet again. There's our bonus book. Alright, now off we go to Kryven's quarters. Awesome. All right, we're in the housekeeping store. Looks like a bunch of rare artifacts are in here. Okay, we gotta find a key and don't kill the television. Wow. <laughs> are, you, are you serious right now? <coughs> that was the easiest challenge I've ever done. Like that Hana TV hasn't even turned on yet. Oh. Let's just go find that bonus book now. Oh, let's freeze the ghoulies. Hey, you didn't even turn on yet. I just felt like killing you. They don't like you. Okay, bonus book's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe in here? No. In here. No. Oh, pff. it's right there in front of Ghoulhaven picture. There's a Dizzy Reaper. Awesome. What else we got over here? Oh, look. Flying Imps. And we are in Kryven's quarters. Oh, it looks like he's hiding in the closet. Whoa. Woe is me! Can anyone save poor old Kryven's from these winged monsters? I'm staying in here until they do. Alright, weapons only and kill the flying imps. Okay, get out of there. Okay, bam. Didn't get all of them. Uh, that's what I thought. There are more of them. Is that all of them? Can't be. There's gotta be one around here somewhere. Oh, there's a couple over there. Okay, let's find something to throw at them. One. Two! Awesome. And they are dead. Cutscene time. See, we can't use our hands. That's why I was using a candlestick. <laughs> my, oh my, what a mess those rotten imps have made. I fear Miss Buff Brass is not going to like this one bit. Thank you for fighting so bravely on my behalf. Now I hear young sir is going to try to help the unfortunate souls that have been prisoned in this no good house. Yeah. Mr. Ibs forced me to, but I'm going to. Most brave of you, sir. Now the only person who has the key to unlock those poor wretches is Baron Von Gul himself. 
However, I'm afraid the door to his quarters is sealed by a powerful magical rhyme. Because he never leaves his room, apparently. I got an idea! Once I had the very rhyme written down, but that uncouth Fiddlesworth told the Baron and he confiscated it. The master ripped it up into three pieces and hid them in the far-flung reaches of the house. What? Don't be disheartened, young sir. I happen to know exactly where they are. There's one in the greenhouse, another in the stables, and... Let's see. Yes, I do recall that the final piece is held by the rather mad Dr. Crackpot in his ghoulie-making laboratory. One, two, three. Yes, I can count. May I recommend that you start with the greenhouse, go upstairs, and down the infirmary fire escape. Mm. From there, it's just a short stroll across the lawns and through the cottage garden. Good luck, sir. Right there, the potting room. Mm. Goodbye. Yeah, we got three pieces of a rock. If I was ghoul, uh, um, if I was, uh, what's his name? Baron Von Ghoul. I would have probably put it in a little bit harder place to, or a little bit more than three pieces. Just throwing that out there. Maybe that's just me. But three pieces. We're going to the greenhouse first, and we have to start here in the housekeeping store. Let's try and find ourselves a bonus book again. Let's. Oh, good. Reverse controls. That means up is down, down is up, left is right, and right is left. And it's just more of a getting used to factor. And knowing when to stop and wait for it to... Oh, good. Speedy Cooper, or Turbo Cooper. Took me forever the first time I played this to figure out what was going on. It was wonderful. Glorious, even. Can't break that open. Cause there's no way in or out. However, break enough of these and we find not that much. How about in here? Merlin! What's going on here? The door ahead is locked with brambles. Seems unfair to lock Sir in without offering him a challenge to escape. Perhaps Sir should have a good look around the room. I think someone is up to mischief here. Even though I just said that. Or he's just a warlock. Not not no special warlock, just a warlock. Two, three, four. Okay. Come on, come down first. And we'll freeze him. Oh, we can't hit him more than once. That's kind of unfair. So I have to wait for him to unfreeze. Yep, just gonna wait here. That's just funny. Um, not what I meant to hit. Okay. Die. Oh, I wanted you to die. He must have learned his magic from Mumbo or Grunt Tilda. Keep it all canon here. Okay. We've been in and out. Six, five, dead. Oh, there was a book in there, too. He was hiding it in his uh, robe. We got ourselves fist. That means we're halfway. Oh my gosh. A Y A B A X A Y. Even though I was nowhere near this thing, it still freaks me out. But yeah, 50 books, that means we're actually, since we missed a few, we're over halfway done with this game. Which is awesome. We're gonna have to find the three... Three pieces of the... Rhyme. Go get the key from Mr. Van Gool. And then 
save prisoners. Doesn't sound that hard, right? Okay, one health, we can use that. Just keep breaking things until we find what we're looking for. Because uh, I don't have to worry about not breaking the house. Oh, good. I know one of them is around here somewhere some t one time. I don't remember when. Maybe I got that one already. I don't remember. I have this horrendous memory. I love how Trader Fever is always in there. Let them beat the crap out of each other for now. One down here looking for uh, stuff. Fun fact, as I said before in an earlier video, the uh, bonus, or the, the, so the swords that the vamp, or, wow, zombie pirates, that's what they're called, when they fall, uh, basically it's just, uh, look, our rare bonus, this is where we're going to have to go, special purple, it means Baron Bungle, it's got the creepy vampire lady in there. Yeah, a rare bonus book is right in front of Baron Von Ghoul's room, which we can't get to until the end of this chapter. Wonderful, right? Alright. In we go. We're trying to get to the greenhouse. I think we have to go to the infirmary first. But first, we are in this upper corridors. Alright, this is not looking good for the... Especially since we have, you know, one health. Okay, watch out because we got a bunch of uh, traitor mummies. You gotta be careful that one of their hits doesn't hit you. Okay, and you don't get hit by the giant. Okay. Oh look, a bunch of bonus books over there. Ours is right there. Okay, can we just get all those? Oh, that's a giant question mark. That's funny. Alright, let's try not to get hit. How are we going to get them out of there? Run! Okay, well that was an interesting little room. And they're all traitors too. Oh look, a bathroom. Yep, bathroom. What? 25 health? What craziness is this? Oh. I love the sounds that Baron Von Gul makes. The higher health you have. He's like, what? Oh, a shocker blocker. I'll probably use that. Oh. That book was in the toilet. I don't know if I really want it. Oh, good. Hands only. Hrumph! It seems so is now forbidden from using anything to help make the fight easier. That's correct. This icon means use no weapons or prepare for more reaping. Beat up this coat. Said nothing about Mini Coopers. You go, Mini Cooper. And you didn't finish him off, and I had to. Oh, good. Ninja Imps. Thought I killed it. Apparently not. Oh, 
Okay, off of me. Okay. This was... I feel like this is just not really a commercial failure, but just... Oh, commercial failure in terms of sales, not in terms of gameplay. This is actually a really good game. I remember that in Nuts and Bolts, Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts for the Xbox 360, they make a bunch of references to Ghoulies and how bad it was. Which I find hilarious because I actually love this game. It was the first game I got for, an X for the Xbox because it came with the console. That and like a Star Wars Tetris, Star Wars slash Tetris thing. Really cool. Alright, did we get them all? Yes, we did. Sweetness! And a Medusa. Hence the shocker blocker that we got earlier. I was like, do we really need it? Apparently we do. Running. Ah! Ah! Hey, I pressed the last button because it can. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, good. The school room. Goodness. This room is one of the more famous ones. Oh, we have to be... We have a minute. Oh, look. It's Royston the fish from uh, Banjo-Kazooie. Yeah, let's just... Let's not dawdle. Aha! Uh -huh, I have to actually push the buttons this time. Y A B B B Y A B. That was easy. Run! Because we have 45 seconds. I'll come back to this room later. Because there's a couple things that I just want to point out. I totally went through the beams and didn't get anything. Um... Okay. Alright guys, this is the end, I'm going to say the end of this episode. Next time we'll continue on to the greenhouse and to get that first piece of the rhyme. Peace out, I'll see you later.